Welcome back everybody to part 12 of the Days Gone walkthrough. So we are continuing from exactly where we left off, so let's get straight into it. Oh hey, that road has been completely demolished by this river, no less. Oh well, at least there's still that bridge. Turned out to be just loots. I saw the little marker thing which indicates enemies, and I decided to check it out. But it was just loot, so I'm going to ignore it. Right, so I guess we're... Bruh. Deke, you there? Hot Springs to Deacon St. John. Tucker, I'm here. I expected you back by now. Did you find the girl, Lisa? No, Tuck, no. The the uh, Rippers cut her up pretty bad. She, uh, she didn't make it. God damn it. We needed her. Now the digging's going to get even further behind. Well, look on the bright side, Tuck. One less mouth to feed, yeah? Well... Alright then, it was a good thing that I did actually skin that wolf, otherwise the talk of Tucker would have been cut off by this cutscene. So good stuff. I wonder why there was just a randomly killed wolf. Our place. Alright, so we've got to get some rest. I mean, to be fair, our guy does so much work. He does work for all the camps in the area, he helps Boozer out, he deals with all the marauders, he does everything. Our poor guy does need a rest, doesn't he? Yo, bro, you, you never... Oh. They're coming. They're coming. Oh, they're gonna... They won't know. I mean, they're on me. Oh, they're gonna... Are what's going on? No! How'd you get in here? Whoa, 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 whoa. You stay right there! Closer, it's me. Stay there. It's Deke. Let's just Don't calm down. Don't you come any closer. Let's just I will talk. kill you. It's all right. Oh, come on, come with the gun. Give me the gun, buddy. No, come I on. will not! Ah! Boozer, what the fuck? I, I heard, I heard him. I heard oh, voices. Shit. Oh shit! Oh, I mean, shit. You, you, you heard him, right? No, I didn't hear shit, Boozer. You no, get blood poisoning. I, I do not. Yes, you do, Boozer. Just take a look. I don't need to take a look. Come on, I mean, we gotta get you some help. Look, I don't need some. Come on. Damn, I don't need help. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, at this point, Boozer's really fucked up. That's what having your entire arm burnt to bits will do. Sorry about that. About trying to blow your head off. I, I mean, no, I thought I saw something, you know? Yeah, boy. Easy. Hey, watch the steps. I got this. But it was, it was in my head, you know? Uh, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Oof, look at those veins. That is definitely blood poisoning. That is some dirty shit. I could hear him, Deke. That's what fever will I do to you. Deke. Footsteps just pounded in my head. Boots. Just a few more steps. Christ. I don't need any help. I can goddamn walk. I can walk. Okay. Okay. To be fair, though, his arm has healed a lot, if you consider I, I just, how it originally looked. I don't, I don't know what happened. I, I saw him. Yeah. Now, come on. Come on. Get on. We gotta go. Come on. Get wait. up. Wait. Wait. What? Where are we going? I, I don't... It's just a short ride. Boozer. It'll help clear your head. Right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yo, look at Let that. Me. What kind of animal carcass is that? A cow? Yeah, something okay. like that. Something huge? All right. Right south to Lost Lake. All right, so this is the place where we where we took Lisa to. All right, cool. Where we going, Deke? You remember when we first rode out of Farewell? What that was like? Yeah, I remember. The highways were they were all choked up with cars. There were so many people, all on the move, thinking that if they could only go fast enough. 
that they'd outrun what was coming. Yeah. No one could move fast enough, Boozer. No one saw it coming the way I did. So by the time they said, fuck it, you know, and started walking and then running, it was too late. Too late. And I remember watching the freaks, watching them all come, thousands of them. And all those, all those dumb shits just got swallowed up. Yeah, I remember. When you see a thing like that, you know it's only a matter of time before it's our turn. Nothing's gonna stop it, Boozer. Not a goddamn thing, but... Wait, do you know why we keep going? No. Because what the hell else are we gonna do? Yeah. That is true. But like, it's in your instincts to survive, like... You have to be in a very dark place if you're able to just ignore those the instincts and shut them out. Like, it's every creature's instinct to survive, so when this shit happens, you run. Or you get on your motorbike and get chased by thousands because they can all hear you. I mean, either one works. Sadly... Ooh! Infestation zone. Sherman's camp. I assume that's this. Well, the bridge is kind of screwed, so, um... And right now, I can't actually use boost. Like, it's not letting me use the nitros. I think it's because we, we're, we're prioritizing Boozer. So let's do that infestation camp afterwards. Let's see where we are on the map. Okay, so we're way down south compared to where we were before. Okay, so it's south of Copeland's camp. So, I've actually been here before. But it was like a bait. There was nothing there. It was, And it became super small the second I saw it. So maybe it's underground or something. I don't know. Yo, this is a long ride. There's corpses everywhere in this area. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. This south area looks far better than that northern area, which has those... Shit, the shitty deserts, the um, the hot springs camp. Like, this is the kind of place that you want to be growing your crops. And look at that, an island, and it's fairly defensible. Why would you not make your base there? Cut down all the trees, set up some barriers. You're golden. Be far better than the freaking hot springs. Lost and found. All right. <laughs> what are you doing? Nothing. Uh, figured you'd get all prettied up before heading in. Oh, uh, you know. Yeah, I figured I'd stop in the lodge, have a few beers, and just stroll into the infirmary. No, 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 man. I'm just, just sick of it. Uh, you know? No, I don't care. I'm just fucking with you. Uh, hey, Deke. Mm. I'm Mike said. He'd kill you if he ever saw you again. Uh, and if he said it... That old man doesn't remember his name half the time. No, no, no. Hey, He'll hey, remember. You gotta stay awake. We're off the open road, but if a freaker wanders back... Yeah, 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 I know. Mm. All right. Hey, Deke. Yeah? Don't you kill anyone in the camp, okay? I'm not gonna kill anyone. You good? Never better. Right. Oh, hello. Who are you then? The Head to the Lost Lake encampment. Not gonna kill anyone. So these guys, I assume, are not bandits, and they're actually from that encampment, and I can't go kill them. Dragging me out here. Shit. We're supposed to guard the camp, not wander around jerking off. Could have been rippers. Oh, against the two of us. Really? We could get them before they. No, 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 no. See, that's what we thought too. Me and this guy, Addy's brother, we went out on patrol. Uh, you know, 
I'm not far from here, really. We kept to the shadows. It was night, but the moon was out. You know ripples love the night. We heard them coming first. Shrieking ripples. They were coming straight out of hell. Now, there, there were maybe four we could see. So we opened up on them. They don't, they don't even try not to get shot. Thing is, they weren't going down. They just kept running at us. But my boy got one of them down, pulled his knife to finish the job. Shit, I should have told him to forget it. Two others climbed right on him, and I fired him. Yeah. yeah, I killed him. What? They were tearing him apart like goddamn freakers. I fired and got the hell out of there. How's it going? Hey. So, you go after Rippers, you better Something's out here. What'd you find? Damn. This camp looking kind of grimy, but they've got a lot of dudes. I don't know. Is this like is this is this like semi Amorita camp? But Nikki seems pretty chill. And I can't kill any of them. But to be honest, if they're the, the good dudes, then I wouldn't want to kill them anyway. But apparently, we're jacking their medicine. Mm, I think. He said he's gonna be rocking up into their infirmary. Hey there. Oh my god, how am I getting past? Oh, okay. Nice and boring guard duty. The way it should be. What are you gonna do later? I'm gonna try to get some sleep, that's what. That girl, Lisa, whatever, the new one, she cries all the damn time. First few days she Rick? kept me up all night. What? A rock? What's her deal? She just came in from the shit. What do you want? Shit. Even money? Sometimes kick her to the curb before you months find? out. Iron Mike won't go for that. He doesn't pay that much attention. Does he even know she's here? I think she's hard to miss. She does cry all the time. And she has been <laughs> quiet lately. Yeah. Maybe she got wise that that wasn't going to help. Yeah, actually, I haven't huh? seen her in a Wait, while. Wait, what? A rock? Yes, mate, a rock. I'm trying to get you to go away. Yo. Oh, damn, no. Someone's here. Yeah, she's there gone. is. Their torches are making their guns really light up. Hey, that was a rock. Yeah, you go over there, and you go over there. What? Hey, a rock. No one cares about your rock. Shut up. Someone's here. Something's wrong. Oh, oh damn. Is that a rock? <laughs> Wait, was that a rock? Oh damn, this guy really doesn't want to leave his post, does he? Who was that? What are you talking? Did I just get caught? Did I get caught? How the hell are you gonna keep the peace with a bunch of crazy ass lunatics who got themselves? How can you trust anything like that? Yeah. Was that a rock? Ugh. Not gonna lie, this is a pretty tough Here. mission. So these guys don't even have any defenses, they literally rely on their guns to defend themselves. Like, bruh, just cut down trees, build up palisades. Are you stupid? And like, just imagine too, if, if you had palisades, I wouldn't even be able to get in. So what are you doing? A rock. Who's out there? Your mom! Oh no. Now I gotcha. Oh, hey, hi, hi. Please don't shoot. No I'm your friend. Whoops. Aww. Hopefully it doesn't put me back too far away. Well. Yeah, okay, it's not too bad. I saw shit. Here you are. Hey. Guys. Hey there. Just walking around, you know? It's official. Um I'm an idiot. Well, Alright, we'll wait for this guy to leave first. Whew. Hey, hey. Sup. No, I'm gonna go around that way. I don't even know if I can, but no. Nah. 
Bre, don't tell me. Oh, shit, Iron Mike, schizo, son of a bitch. Joe's got scars all along his head, like you were trying to scalp him. Raymond and the men we buried. <gasps> what? Butchered, Mike. Butchered. Christ, it took us three hours to rake up all the body parts. Bre. I want to leave him for the freaks. Raymond, it's Carlos, and you know it. We gotta hit him back, or the Rippers are gonna. Rip, schizo, leave it be. Just leave it be. Okay, so that's Iron Mike and Schizo. Mike, and the next. Hell, Carlos is already pushing into Rogue Camp. Camp Pioneer. There's no proof of that. They're moving up north. I heard one of those radio free origin broadcasts. Claims they got hit by Rippers. So now you're listening to that nut job, Cope. Well, he may be a nut job, but I think he'd know a Ripper if one was coming at him with a butcher knife. That is, that's fair. That is fair. He might be one of the true for morons, but yeah, he's he's not a lunatic. Well, he, he might be a lunatic, but I'm I'm pretty sure he knows that when uh, a dude covered in scars comes out with a butcher knife. So yeah. God damn, there's too many guards. How am I even? To be honest, like it's not surprised me that I've been caught twice already. They're not at here. all. But you can go in and see for yourself. You'll come back. You know, Addy don't like it. Let's, let's go. That? Come on, don't catch me. Hey! Oi, go away! Shh! Shh! I'm not here! Fuck off! There it is. I just gotta find a way inside. Why? You trying to get with them? Or is this going in your thing? Oh, man. I'm just curious. I'm some kitchen dude. Got it. Alright, I'm in the infirmary. Let's steal their meds. I mean, not gonna lie, I feel, I feel kinda shitty about this. Oof. Oh, you can bet I'm getting jumped. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Hi, Ricky. Hi, Addy. Uh, <laughs> I don't want any trouble. So if you ladies just step aside, I'll show you. No, no, my no way. what the what hell the are you doing in my doing? infirmary? Oh, are you gonna the shoot The nonchalance now? about the way he said hi. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's a code, right? You can't shoot a woman unless you have to. Well, now you have to. Ooh. Yo, she's quick on the draw. Ah, shit. Okay, look, why don't you just let me explain? Check what's in the cooler. <sighs> Surely they know what's in the cooler the because that now? was their antibiotics. And when you brought me that girl, I thought you had changed. But clearly you haven't. No, it's not narcotics. What? It's antibiotics. Boozers. Sick. He's got blood poisoning. I had no place else to go. Blood poisoning. What happened? Does it matter? I fucked up. Bring him in. Go and get him. Bring him here. No, we can't do that. Yes, we can. Look, I don't care who he is, and I don't care what Iron Mike thinks. When a man is sick, a man is sick. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. Her thinking like that is fairly chill. We have to look out for each other. Baby is all we got. Yo, honestly, the way she's reacted is super chill, not gonna lie. Like, when someone's stealing your meds, that's a crime that you punish with death. Come on, I'll give you a ride. Alright, let's go with Nick Ricky. And hopefully we don't get caught by Schizo and Iron Mike. You remember there was a small camp when we first rode into the valley? Yeah, I remember. You call this a bike? It may not be a fancy drifter bike, but it gets the job done. Get on. All right. So this is the first time since the start of the series when I was actually on Booze's bike that I've that I've uh, ridden on the back, not controlling it. I used to be a cop, believe it or not. Very well. Oh hey, the guy was a cop. Good for him. So how's she doing? The girl that I brought in, Lisa. Are you, are you gonna take me to see her? No. Oh, God damn it, Ricky. What? What the hell? Why not? I can't. She's not here. Wait, wait. Hold on for a second. Where is she? A few days ago, Schizo assigned her to a scavenge run. She and three others headed over to the rogue camp to look for supplies. They came back without her. What? You're telling me they left her? They left her out in the shit. 
They didn't leave anyone. They said she ran off. Jesus! It could have been anything. Wolves, freaks, rippers. Choose your poison. And what, what, what was Schizo thinking, sending her out on a supply run? Everyone's gotta work, Deke. That's the deal, and you know it. I don't believe this shit. Look, she'd been surviving in Marion Forks for years when I found her. Yeah, then maybe you should have left her there. True that. Literally, the only reason that he took her out of Marion Forks is because he wanted credits from Tucker. Who's there? Hey. Get back, don't make me blow your goddamn Who's head there? off. It's me. No, get back! Oh. Hey. Hey, it's, uh, it's Ricky. <laughs> you remember me? I rode with you guys a year ago. Ricky. What? Tell me Yo, all... look at that sweat. Yeah. That's good. Tell me all the... the last lake? Yeah. Yeah, man. Hold up, hold up. That's right. How, how you doing there, loser? You doing uh, all right? PG. It still didn't give you the right to steal our shit. Are you kidding me? Look at his arm. What was I supposed to do? Huh? I, I don't know. Maybe ask. Jesus. Look at you guys, the biker boys. The most badass drifters in this shit, right? Now you come back crawling to Iron Mike. Oh, wait. If he'll let you. <laughs> come on, just help me get him back to Addy. Yeah. Let's go. Damn. His arm has definitely That's healed a lot since he first got burned, though. Honestly, yeah. like, he'd be perfectly fine as long as he wasn't, well, had the blood poisoning. Ricky. Yeah, Boozer Ricky. I'm not going to lie, that skin has healed too much. Like, you don't come back from third degree burns. So, God knows. Get on, Booze Man. Wait, where, where are we going? Addy said she's agreed to, to take a look at your arm and, and see what she can do. What? No. No, you're not taking me to some goddamn camp. I can ride, damn it. We're not sa Damn it. Boozer, it's just for a few days. Get some shit for your arm and then... No. You know what it's like there, Deke. No, you're not thinking straight. This isn't the Hot Springs. This is Lost Lake. Iron Mike. Remember him? Iron Mike? Who's gonna get us killed? He said. That was a long time ago. They built the place up. They, they got more people. We're all gonna fucking die. We'll be long gone before anything like that happens. Camp's got the only dock in a hundred miles. Now, Addy, just look, she'll take care of it. Just, just a couple of days. Yeah, then we ride the hell out of here. Right north. Like you said. Get the hell away Jim. from all this. Yeah. Yeah, we ride north. Leave all this shit behind. I'm sorry, did I take your parking space? Okay, so I'm gonna go back and check on him and make sure he's okay. Coward. Yeah, you got that right. Well, how long? And until he can ride, I mean. You mean how long do you have to be here? Yes. Look, we have antibiotics, but it's not enough. Iron Mike lets you stay. Your friend will have a chance. And it seems to me there's some bad blood between Iron Mike and uh, Deacon. Like apparently Iron Mike said that the next so time happened? he sees him, he'll How kill him. How do you burn him. his arm like that? We ran into some rippers south of Belknap. Guess they didn't like his tattoos. Jesus, I've heard about him doing shit like that to themselves. But not to people they're trying to recruit. <sighs> Boozer wasn't any goddamn recruit. Uh, guess Tucker should have made a deal with him like Iron Mike. Come on, Ricky. He just he doesn't get it. Carlos isn't gonna honor any deal with Lost Lake, not for long anyway. And Mike, he just doesn't see it. He sees more than you think. You've always had your good side, Deke. You've just been doing your best to kill it. <sighs> Thanks for the vote of confidence. Genuinely. Like, apparently she knows Deacon very well. But they did say that they rode together. So she used to be our Alvarez, I guess. Christ. Let's go steal with Iron Mike. I wonder if he's going to put a gun on us the second he sees you us. You cannot believe a word he is going to say. 
<laughs> Eddie is soft. Mike, we do not have enough for those that pull their own weight, let alone a goddamn cripple. He's oh, not a cripple. He can work. He... I say we throw them out on their asses. Mike, that is not who we are. Jesus. Listen to you. And you. You tired of being Tucker's little bitch, finally? Raymond, huh? stop it! Don't call me that! I'm pretty tired, all right. All right, See? enough! See? You know who the fuck this guy is, and you know what he... You hold on! And you! You put that shit away. Mike, Deacon was I one that know. brought me the gr I know. Why have you still got your gun and out, I big boy? I know what kind of man he is. What he's done. He done any worse than you? Ricky? No. How about not. me? We've all been out in this shit, Schizo. We've all done things we're not proud of. We need another rider. Oh, now, wait a minute. I just need a few days and some antibiotics. <laughs> Man, they're not going to give you it for free. Whatever it takes. Sure, Mike. Whatever you say, I'm on board. Walk with me. So apparently, Iron Mike is a fairly chill dude. Don't you start with me. <sighs> so you're the one who brought him in. I didn't bring them in, Schizo. Boozer needed help. But he broke into the infirmary. The tackle shop isn't exactly secure. Ricky told me you stopped you running for Tucker. Sent that little girl oh, here so instead. You're hooked up with I'm sorry I lied so to you go before about doing bombs. runs for Tucker. Isn't that your job? How long you been drifting? No. You and Bill. I don't know. Like I said, time gets lost. If folks don't put down some roots, figure this shit out, grow some food, come next spring, won't be none of us left. Yep. Canned food only lasts so long. It may be canned, but it still has an expiration date. What he needs, let us hold up here till he can ride. Like I said, I will do whatever you need. I just, I, I want you to know that as soon as he's patched up, we're going to put together some gear. We're going to ride north. North, huh? There's a camp up there near Smith Rock. Boozer's never been there. Anyway, got a lot of ghosts down here. It's time we move on. Fresh start, eh? Yeah, I can respect that. Now go on. Leave me be. I got some thinking to do. Oh, okay. Sure, Mike. Yeah, whatever you say. Just have Ricky radio me if you need something. <laughs> that was a short talk. I thought it was going to be some long speech. Alright. Um. Yo, we can actually use their facilities. Apparently we even have a bed. How kind of them. Wait, is this where you hand in the bounties? Oh, that's kitchen. Actually, we've got some wolves that we can uh, sell them. Bleh. Alright, let's uh, sell all. Yo, look at how few credits we've got with this camp. That's it for now. Damn. Wait. What? Oh, okay. Alright, chill. Yeah, seriously though, they need to start cutting down their trees and building up palisades. This is a shit camp. They got people out in the open. Deacon, hey, is everything okay? What's wrong? Uh, actually, that's not why I'm here. Okay. Came by to see if there's anything you need for the uh, infirmary. Actually, we're running low on everything. I mean, we could always use more meds, sterile bandages, instruments. Uh, here. Hmm. Liston knife. Yeah, it was used by doctors in the Civil War to perform operations in the field. Operations? Yeah, you know, when they didn't have any anesthesia or laudanum. I wrote down where you might be able to find one. 
It's the brochure for the visitor center at Sherman Sherman's camp. camp. Yeah, yeah the place there's an infestation the there. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> yeah, uh, Deacon. Thank you. Honestly, no, you don't even owe us thanks at this point. You've been ridiculously chill. If this was literally anyone else, we would have been shot by Ricky then and there. Just a knife. Head to Sherman's camp. The place is gonna be crawling. Hey, Serious. Just mind your store. Your bike definitely needs some work, man. Bruh. Bruh. This is what I want. Trust level one. Look at that top speed, bruh. That is a thing of beauty. Yeah, so apparently all the good stuff is sold by this dude's. Oh, 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 look at that. Oh, yes. Look at how much ammo you can get with that, bruh. All right, I'm going to get myself come trust back, level one, then I'll come back. Go on. Get out of here. Let's go get that Liston knife. Hold on a sec. I'll open it. Copeland, Deacon St. John, come in. Deke, you out there? Hey, Cope. Yeah, let me guess, you got a job for me. Okay. Uh, I'll swing by when I get a chance. Deacon out. Shit. Ah, <laughs> oh, balls. Where'd he go? Yo, bruh. <laughs> There we go. Christ, I waste way too much ammo for Finally. Hello? Is anyone on this channel? Hello, O'Brien. What do you want, bro? You? Yes. Y yeah, it's, it's O'Brien. You still have one of our radios. Good. Okay, look. I'm going to try and help you. Find out about the woman. Sarah Whitaker. I put her on your chopper that night. Y yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Okay, but first, you got to do something. Wait, what? You need something from me? Look, there's a digital display on your radio. I'm going to send you a coded message, coordinates. Meet me at that location. O'Brien, what the hell is this all about? Just meet me there. There'll be Nero soldiers all around me like before. Just don't let them see you. O'Brien out. Fun. So we've actually got a lot of missions now. We've got a Copeland one and a O'Brien one and the, and the ones that we're currently doing for this new... New camp? Is it Lost Lake? Is that what it's called? Ooh. Alright, let's hit that, that police uh, car on the way back from clearing out this infestation. Sherman's camp. Getting close. Yeah. I gotta finish burning out this infestation zone. <gasps> Damn it, sniper ambush. Oh! The bastard got my... Fucking engine. Oh no! Down. Yo, he's got an axe, that's mine. Gimme! Oh, nah. Okay, so apparently it's a pile of shit. Like, the damage is good, but the durability is bold. No more ambush characters for you, huh? Yeah. Goddamn ambushes. I'll come back later, finish burning out these nests. And why is it that I'm literally the only person that ever deals with infestations? Hmm? Let's go get that dude's ammo. Topping off. There we go. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, repair our bike. Where is it? All the way over there, alright. Let's repair our bike and then get back up to uh, Sherman Camp, which I think is right here. Christ, look at my poor <laughs> engine. They shot it right in the engine. Six percent durability. Uh, Damn. Not too bad. That should do it. I can't wait to get the better engine because the top speed will be so much higher. Actually, let's stop off at this gas station and refill. Here it is. Oh, 
Yo, shit. I thought those were loots, not proper ones. Not swarmers. Oh, damn, bro. Oh, shit, wrong one. Right on target. Are they are these guys dodging bullets? More bounties. More bounties is good. Mm-hmm. Am I hearing a gun right now? Nah, there's nothing in there for me. One second, where is this? Alright, so that's the Liston knife. And that's the infestation. Alright. Let's get back on our bike and turn it around. Visitor center. Gotta find a way inside. Hmm. I smell it. It's gotta be getting close. Door's locked. What's good, homeboy? Nah, that didn't do shit. I wasted one. Damn, bro. Hmm. Might be useful. Always take bibbles. Come on, hurry up and burn out. Come on! Alright, there we are. Yeah, nothing in there for me apart from residue, which I'm already max on. Alright, so I'm not getting in through there. Alright, this is how I'm getting in. Oh, shit, almost out. Yo, I really am almost out on my uh, assault rifle. Oof. Fire escape. Well, I guess we're going downstairs. Down here. Not much left. This place has been picked over clean. Alright, that's our Liston knife. There's even a horseshoe. Nice. Liston knife. This is it. Gotta get it back to Addy. Alright, let's uh, deal with the infestation first. Yeah. Ingredient from Molotov, so I'll take it. Now then, where, pray tell, are these infestations? Well, the nests. There has to be one in here. Has to be. Must be upstairs. Wait, how is there not one in here? What? Like, it's got all the shit that they'd throw everywhere when they've got an infestation. What's, what, what's Addy, going on? Addy, I got that knife you were looking for. Thank you, Deacon. You have no idea how badly we need this. No problem. Glad to help. Gotta be close to a nest. Whew, I can smell it. Close to a nest? Where? Bruh. Like, they have the telltale signs of the modern ship being um, spread all over the walls and stuff, but ugh. Can't see anything. Hmm. He's upstairs, maybe. Let's check up. Let's check up on the roof. Yeah, at least it's parts. <laughs> Nothing like scrap. All right. Hmm. Yo, bottle, yes. And a rag. Good stuff. Hmm. 
I have no clue where these damn nests are. Okay, this is one over there. I love it when it's, you get close enough, it actually shows up on your damn map. Where is it? God damn, that's gotta be close. Another one. Yeah, time to light it up. Shit. Right, there we go. That should be that infestation dealt with. Yo, get in! Bruh. Bruh, no. Get through the freaking window. Are you kidding me right now? Whatever, whatever, whatever. Man. Let's have a look in here. Wait. Why did it say this nest is still there? Is there more than one? No. What's going on? Ah, that's why. There was another literally right below it. There we are. Good stuff. Alright, um... Yeah, let's get back on our bike and go back to the police car that we saw. Get some ammo, because we really badly need it, because we're literally out of assault rifle ammo. And there's one more here. Sweet. Let's check this one. Hopefully we can get max ammo from this. Right, there's my bike. I can't wait until we can get that better engine because the top speed seems to be so much higher. I wonder if there's any better nitros we can get. <gasps> what? God damn it, not now. Bro, I was not expecting that. <gasps> oh, shit, my balls. She's gonna sit, huh? <laughs> down. Oh, oh. How would you like me now, you little shits? Alright, let's craft this. There we go. Just in case what we actually pick up from them turns out to be something good. Alright, let's open the police car and uh ugh. I'm gonna have to pop some hoods and get some more parts. Because I'm actually low right now, I'm only on four. That ain't good. Zero percent dribbling, damn. This. Yep. With our current amount of parts, we could only get 60%. God damn. We need to pop a lot of hoods, guys. Let's repair the rest of the engine and then pop the rest of the hoods. Uh, it doesn't look too bad. Let's there we go. are. Alright, both of those hoods are already popped. This one isn't. So let's do that. Goddamn ambushes, man. I didn't even see that the rope that got me. I really didn't. Yeah, what's in the back of this? No, 
Oh, medkit. Nice. So this is where they slept before they'd come out of their little holes to uh, ambush people. Right. Not very secure, is it, though? weapon soon. One second, guys. Yo, our, our weapon really is balls. Oh, looking at it, they do actually have their island, their little thing on an island. Hmm, not bad. Someone's here. Yes, Mina, open the fuck up. Open the gate. We're watching you. Shut up. So, uh, a couple months ago, we were up by Crazy Willies, scavenging, you know. Hey. Oh, here's that knife you were looking for. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Ah, uh, we're still halfway from actually trust level one, so we can use their get some of their parts. All right. Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, I will be ending this episode here. So if you'd like to see more, you, know, you guys know what to do. Just leave a like and subscribe. And please help support the channel by telling your friends, family and fellow gamers about us as well. So I'll be seeing you in the next one. Peace!